Hi everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how to set up and balance a Glidecam HD2000. Now once you have the camera mounted, what you're going to want to start with is by adding these weights. Uh, and on this, for this camera I usually use about three on the back, one on the front. Um, now once you have them placed, you then lock them in with these, just these little knobs. Um, and then you can actually adjust how far back they go. You can make it a lot back, which will, like, for example, on the back end, if you bring it out more, it'll make the camera tilt more backward. Whereas if you bring out this one more forward, it'll make the camera tilt more forward. And so then you just use that to try and balance it uh, so it doesn't tilt either forward or back at all. Then once you have that set up, I would then want to go to these little knobs. Now these knobs I call the fine tuning knobs. And there's one located right here on the left, and there's another one located on the back right here. Now what these control are little metal plates right underneath the camera. And what you want to do is adjust them. Basically this one on the back controls how much it goes tilts backward or forward, and basically it takes care of the last 10% of balancing the camera, because the weights on the bottom can't do all the work. And then this one on the left controls how much it tilts to the left and to the right. And so then you'll just tweak with them until, until you get it even, until it stops tilting forward or back or left or right. Alright, now aside from adjusting the weights and the knobs, what you'll also want to do is set the length of the pole. Now where I usually set it, it's just about an inch from the bottom. This knob, I said about an inch from the bottom, and that's usually what works best to balance it in my experience. And that is how you set up a Glidecam HD2000. Okay, everyone, that brings us to the end of the video. I hope this was very informative for you, and thanks for watching.